Ito na yung buhay mo, siya mo doon. Maybe if there's another timeline. Ah, gosh. I'd, I'd still be pursuing this. I'd still be pursuing this. I never saw myself doing anything else. I remember, I remember growing up, you know, even when I was working in the States, or even here when I was still studying, gusto ko talaga not necessarily be an artista, but, pero gusto ko umarte. You know, I don't know if it was coming from the gut, but I always, I always felt that there was something in it for me. You know, to be in the business, you know, being the shy person that I am, I was. Uh, hindi ko makita yung sarili ko, you know, doing other things. Growing up, I wanted to be a pilot because I wanted to fly. But now looking at the, the pilots who fly the plane, it's so much pressure. So okay na ako sa pressure dito sa showbiz, pero parang yung pressure to fly every time. And parang, buti na lang, hindi ko lang yung pilot. I wanted to be a newscaster. I wanted to be an anchor. Pero I think I'm in a better place, you know, not to compare or anything. So. I would not want to be able to trade my life now, you know, for something that, you know, I, I just cannot picture myself doing other things, you know, uh, other than this. I want to be a pastor. I want to be, I want to be able to preach. I want to be able to share my life or my faith. But uh, that's another story, you know. If I'm able to influence and use my influence in this business uh, the way I am doing it now, then... I'm fulfilling another dream, but if I'm if I'm to be used for something else, then as long as it's God's plan for me, as long as it's His purpose, you know, you know, who am I to refuse? But for now, I just cannot see myself doing anything else aside from this.